after removing the sump, cylinder number one was playing too much. This is where the knocking sound came from. So we are going to do the engine overall on this GD27. Welcome to the Highway Pro. Uh, if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe, comment and like. Yeah. My name is Patsurai. So we are going to redo the TD27, removing everything, changing the bearings, rocker shaft, this is our rocker shaft, and uh, yeah, our push rods off. So yeah. The head, head down, and the engine out. So we are going to strip everything on this car, on this engine, TD27, and uh, yeah, this is our timing marks on uh, Injector pump and uh, yeah, the cover. So, this type of an engine did it when seven of uh, it's got uh, gears, and this is our timing marks again on the gears, stripping off everything, camshaft, oh. Cover off, and this is our oil pump. So, the main goals of this are uh, uh, engine knocks can be caused by the oil pump failing to supply enough oil. So we are just checking if our oil pump is still on good condition, but on this case we are going to change the oil pump. Checking uh, the seal, the filings, everything. The piston out. So this bearing is the main cause of the knocking sound on cylinder number one. So yeah. So we are going to change the bearings, the rings, oil pump, uh, taking the block to the engineers so that uh, they can examine everything. Crank shaft, crank shaft, but our crank shaft is uh, we are going to find a new crank shaft on this case again because it's uh, damaged too much. So thank you for watching Highway Pro. See you on the next video.